My name is Patrick Ngo. I live in East San Jose, and I currently work as a youth counselor doing gang intervention for uh, Southeast Asian and Latino youth. I have a father, a mother, an older sister, and a younger sister. And uh, when I was younger, my mother owned a nail salon, and she operated it for about eight years, I believe. I'm not really sure. I was um, probably only around eight, or seven, eight years old. And one of the things that makes my family strong is we've been through a lot. Uh, my family were refugees, um, just like most other Vietnamese families. They've, um, we've lost a lot, even in America. We've been through bankruptcy, and uh, we've rebuilt our lives um, through different types of struggles. And I feel like that's one of the things that makes our fa my family very strong. One of the things I feel like my family still needs to this day is definitely um, for the children, all the, my, me and my sisters, to actually make money. We all do community work and we um, studied liberal arts in college and it doesn't make a lot of money. I love my work, but it doesn't make a lot. My sister's doing social work, it doesn't make a lot. So definitely uh, finances is a, a, an issue that my family needs because we do, um, my parents um, don't have retirement funds or anything. So um, I, I want to take care of my family and that's definitely um, something we need to work on. Uh, so in East San Jose, there um, are Nail salons are a dime a dozen. There are probably almost as many nail salons as there are liquor stores in East San Jose, and they're owned primarily by Vietnamese people. And I feel like the issue with a lot of um, businesses in um, San Jose is a lot of Vietnamese people are reliant on very um, low-paying, um, easy-money jobs. So working nail salons, a lot of new immigrants too, they come in thinking, hey, I can make a lot of money and uh, they rely on these jobs and it's not healthy for them and it um, holds them into um, a, a system where they cannot really get out of poverty and I feel like that's a really big issue in the community.